Probably my number one favorite artist working today is an artist named Chris Somni. He is basically in Marvel's like full-time roster. And Chris Somni and Matt Wilson as a team, they make some of the most beautifully like colored books. Like oh, the color palettes that they choose are really fantastic. His inking is great. And last year I actually was able to purchase a page by Chris Somni, which I have hung up in my studio. I love his storytelling and I love his art style. So he's he's someone I really want to meet and like thank. <laughs> so he's fantastic. Actually, just this afternoon, I spoke with a, a woman who uh, was in charge of Harris County Libraries. And I'm from Houston, Texas, so Harris County Libraries are the libraries that I grew up going to. And we had a really touching moment because she talked about how much Harvey, um, uh, the, the hurricane that came through, like really like destroyed um, over up to $3 million worth of books in the library. And you know, th these are books that I probably touched too that were da damaged and destroyed. But it was a kind of a happy ending because not only did they, were they able to like rebuild a lot of those collections, she now has knowledge that can help other libraries to prevent that from ever happening. So that just happened like an hour ago and we were both crying. <laughs> but it was just like, it's, it's part of life and you really can get those connections at conferences like this. I think libraries are so important to me because Check Please started off as a webcomic and it built an audience there, but the book being in libraries, it's reaching an audience that it, it would never have reached before. So I'm running into students who are telling me like they discovered Check Please because their librarian recommended it to them and they have no idea that it's online. So it's a totally different audience.